Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, I'm going to be sharing five powerful tips for the Samsung Notes application for all Samsung Galaxy smartphones. Now, you can use an S Pen or just your finger. All these tips apply equally, and of course, I'm talking about Samsung Notes, which is this thing right here. It can do some incredible things. So let's dive in and get started right away. All right, so the very first feature that I want to talk about is known as the straighten text feature. So here. I have a handwritten note and I purposefully wrote this diagonally as you can see sometimes when we take a note it is not always straight we might write it sideways now the good news is once you go to edit that note or while you are taking the note what you can do is you can access this bar at the bottom okay and there's a feature right over here if you hover on this with your S Pen it says straighten so if I tap on this one what it's going to do is it is going to take the text, the handwritten text, and it's going to make that straight so it looks much better. After you tap on that button, you tap right here, and that is now a straight note. Looks much better. This, of course, is just a small example. You can apply this to even a larger note. Now, to make sure that this feature is active because it does need to be activated, what you do want to do is you want to go to the main screen of your Samsung Notes application, tap on this button, go into the notes, okay, and scroll all the way down and go to toolbar add-ons. Tap on it and make sure all these guys are in fact enabled. The one we just use is right here, but all the other ones are very useful features as well. I'm going to talk about a bunch of them in a second. Just make sure toolbar add-ons are enabled. And I do want to let you know when it says toolbar, it is talking about this toolbar right here. That's the toolbar, and those are the add-ons that are being enabled and added right here. All right, so let's talk about the next feature. The next feature is converting a handwritten note into a text. So again, you focus in on the note that you want to convert to standard text, okay? And then over here, when I hover over this, it says convert to text. So if I tap on this guy, it is going to select that text on the screen and look at this. I have an option here. I can copy that text or I can convert that text. When I tap on convert, that goes into regular text format. So great for taking notes and later turning into a standard text. Now let me undo this. I'm going to show you one more thing in relation to this tactic. So this thing right here, when I tap on the convert text feature, I can also make this window smaller and only choose the portion I want to actually convert. So in this example, if I go up, it converts the whole thing. But let's say I just want to convert the news portion here. I just go down, look at that, narrows that down, tap on convert, and it goes right there. This one is still handwritten. So again, these are great ways to customize your notes. Now let's move on to the next tactic. But before we do that, just a quick word from our sponsor. A quick word from our sponsor, Skillshare. Let me ask you a quick question. What do you want to learn in 2022? What new skill set do you want to add to your portfolio? And now let me quickly tell you what I did. So recently I had a desire to start learning to use Adobe Premiere Pro for video editing to add it to my skill set. And I was looking for some high quality advanced classes and tutorials to get me started. Skillshare.com came to the rescue. I was even able to specify that I was looking for advanced advanced level classes and found a fantastic class by Jordi Vandeput which made me five times better than I was before and of course for the same topic they have beginner intermediate or advanced level classes in fact they have that for every topic so basically you can learn anything on skillshare.com it is an online learning community with classes on virtually every subject imaginable designed for people who want to invest in their personal growth by learning about what inspires them now to make it easy for you so that you can learn a specific skill for personal growth the first 1000 of my viewers to sign up using my code Saki tech or or my link in the description will get a one month free trial of Skillshare so you can start exploring your creativity today. The best investment is when you invest in yourself and this one here is going to get you started for free. All right, the next feature I'll be talking about actually is converting handwritten notes to text on the fly. So let me show you what I'm talking about. Let me just so let me scroll down over here and go to the new page and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use this option here. Now this one is S Pen to text option for Samsung Notes. 
Now, if I click on this guy, I can actually convert to text on the fly. So here is an example. So if I write, hi, I can write any way or shape or form. Well, that wasn't that clear, but let's do it one more time. Let's say hi, okay? And that's gonna convert that to text on the fly. So I can write anywhere, and it's gonna send it to the top right over here, okay? And you wanna have this bar here, you can use the space button, and hello, how, for example, okay? And I can tap on this, or, that is bad. But look at how the conversion is so accurate. The conversion AI is really top notch here, okay? So you can do that as well. Convert to text on the fly, uh, handwrite to text. Now the next feature I'm gonna talk about has to do with shapes. Now you may know this feature already, but there's actually some additional details to this feature. So how to draw perfect shapes and arrows just like this one. So again, let me go to a new page. In fact, let me just create a brand new note right over here. Okay, what you want to do is first you want to go to the pen mode or if you're using your finger, that's fine as well. And then you scroll over and you tap on the option here that says auto fix shapes. And then anytime you draw a circle, it's going to make that into a perfect circle. Do with the uh, rectangles. Let's do an actual rectangle. There we go. Triangles, whatever you want to do. Okay, so you're going to get that perfect shape. And if you do an arrow, that's gonna turn into an arrow as well. And even if you write something like a little number here, that's gonna turn into a little, you know, uh, clearer one. Or if I write two, let's see what that looks like. See, so if you have this option enabled, uh, it works with this as well. Now here's the additional thing you can do that you probably don't know. You can actually look at this. If I wanna delete this guy, I cannot grab this eraser and delete it. What I have to do is I can tap on it and I can delete it from here. But on top of that, I can tap on these guys and I can change the size of it. I can move it around. Okay, so I can rearrange these. I can copy and paste. Look at this. I have all these options. I can also rotate them. Okay, so look at this guy. I can even make it this longer. So, so many things you can do with the Samsung Notes application if you want to draw some flow charts. Remember, when you tap on an item, you can uh, do all these things, and also you can tap over here, and you can do additional things as you can see. So that is fantastic, drawing perfect shapes to create great charts. Let's move on and talk about the final tactic that you're gonna love. So let's say that you wanna sign a document. Somebody sends you a PDF file via an email and you wanna quickly sign that and send it back to them. All you do is you come to your notes application in the main screen, you tap on this PDF plus, it says import PDF, you tap on it. So if you have any PDF documents, uh, they're gonna show up right here. So let me just uh, pull something in here. I'm just gonna tap this as an example. Okay, so I'm gonna import this PDF file into Samsung Notes, so now it's right here. And let's say this was a document that you had to sign, and let's say you had to sign right over here, okay, somebody asked you to sign it, that's all you do, you import the PDF file, you grab your pen or your finger, and boom, you sign whatever you want, and then when you're done, you tap on this button here, okay, you can save the file or just share the file back to the person that sent it to you. Or, like I said, you can just save the file if it is for your own record. So you can sign any document on the Samsung Notes application with Finger or the S Pen easily with this tactic. That's a great productivity tool. And that is our final tactic. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop it down below. Let me know for now, guys. Have a fantastic day, all right?